Greetings! You know me as Petey McDougal, Canadian nerd. You also know me as Petey Falcone, New York dork. Like other misfits of my ilk, I never really felt like I fit in. Hello. Congratulations! This was especially apparent in our old life among the family. Yo, Petey, try this lasagna. It's like angels singing in your mouth. No thanks, I'm lactose intolerant, and pasta's not good for my gluten sensitivity. You know what makes me sensitive? Jagoffs with no manners. Eat the fucking food, you mook. Hey, kid, have some wine. I won't tell you folks. Actually, it was their idea. You need to loosen up. Cheech, I've seen what alcohol does to people, namely you. And it won't work. Have to live a little, kid. <laughs> what are you doing? The bride gave birth to a boy this morning. We're celebrating. Smoke up, kid. It's bad luck if you don't. Really? Hell if I know. <laughs> I was gonna steal that, dumbass! Now that we're in Canada, I finally feel like I fit in. And I'm sure in time, the rest of my family will learn to love it here as much as I do. Forget about it! Let me tell you something about a friend of ours named Jimmy. I made the wise guy and the capo with the gambini. But when he found out that they'd be whacking Uncle Cheech, he take the boss, he threw him from the 19th floor suite. Wasn't much along till the mob all wants him dead. So Jimmy had no choice but to talk to all the feds. The feds will say they heard that they could use him as a pawn. So he ratted out his friends and moved to Saskatchewan. Forget about it. Forget about it. Forget about it. Oh, forget about it. Ah, keep jerking it, Jetsy. Oh, almost there. Mm. That's it. Yeah, that's good. Mm. 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 Relax, Cookie. It's not what you think. I'm sure there's a logical. Slide it in and out. Slowly. Okay. You went to a Catholic school. This kind of thing happens all the time. And... Oh, God, listen to yourself. <laughs> you pricked me. Spit that out. You do not want to swallow it. Jesus Christ on a bike! Ta-da! What do you think? Cheech, we're trying to keep a low profile here, so you go and swipe a boat? Swipe? Give me some credit. I got it at the police auction. Let's start the bidding at 500. Who'll give me five? So! <laughs> it was a steal, Jimmy. Except I paid for it. We live on the prairies. What are we gonna sail on, seas of wheat? There's a lake near here. We'll go fishing like the old days. Except without the dead wise guys clogging up the water. Cheech, I'm married. I can't just take off whenever I want. I was married. I took off all the time. And how'd that work out for you? I'm gonna die alone. I gotta clear this kind of stuff with Cookie. I gotta drop reminders, sweet talker, negotiate terms. Peace in the Middle East to take less diplomacy. Hey, Cook, we're going fishing. Great idea! Absolutely! Go fishing! Get out of here! Far away from Petey! Huh? Never mind. Just go. <sighs> oh, no, wait! There is something we need to talk about. Love you, Ben! So, I think your brother might be... gay. And if he is, I want to make sure neither of you gives him a hard time about it. What do you take us for? He's our brother! I know we bust his balls, but we got his back. Apparently, so does Jetsy. <laughs> Teresa, what did I say? Ma, I'm just playing. Well, stop. I'm having a hard time with this. Get over it. You want to wind up like Mrs. Scavuzzo? She rejected her boy because he was gay. Died alone. Cats ate a face. You want that, Ma? You want a cat eating your face? Because I know a guy. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> you can act like a mom! and never buy a cat. You're right. I can do this. I'm gonna be the best damn mother of a gay you ever saw. You know he's not, right? Oh God, of course. He's not cool enough to be gay. If he was, at least he'd have a personality. <laughs> this is fun. What are we bonding now? Shut up! I tell you, Cheech, you can't beat the peace and quiet of a fishing trip. Oh, you want some of this? Who's a big fish now? Say hi to your mother for me. Big leg, fish dick. I got 
get your kitchen release right here, you fucking mutt. You broke my heart, you scaly prick! I'm out. Me too. So relaxing. Now them fishes are sleeping with the fishes. <laughs> <laughs> Young Petey is a homosexual. Splendid. I'm glad you called me, Cookie. Good. Because I don't know how to tell him he has my support. Can you help me out? I can do better than help you, Cookie. I can refer you to a qualified colleague. And no, I'm not deflecting your request because it makes me uncomfortable. Here in Canada, we pride ourselves on our pride. By the by, how's Jimmy taking this? Oh, God. Jimmy doesn't know anything yet. He's gone fishing with Cheech. Fishing? I got no idea what Jimmy will do when he finds out. Did he mention being angry with me? Because I've told him I'm an avid fisherman. But he loves Petey, so who knows? I'm sorry, what? Just checking for texts from Jimmy. No, nothing here. Do you think it would be weird if I just showed up? Showed up where? At the fishing trip. I thought we were talking about Petey. Oh, right, I'll get my colleague to come see you. For Canada! Where friends are supposed to tell friends about fishing trips. <laughs> Don't move! Who? Don't move, I said! What the hell? Look at me. Look at me. I am the captain now. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't look at you. You look at me. Look at me! Look at me! Look at me! Look at me! Don't look at me. Look at him. Look at me! Look at me! Don't say look at me, just look at me! Look at me! Look at you, being all, look at me! Look at me! Hey, look at me! Oh. Enough! I am Giddy. This is Johnny. We own this boat now, understand? Hey, I own this boat, pal. You want it? Make me an offer. I'll shoot your fat friend and dump him over the side. Hey, Jimmy, quiet. I'm negotiating here. All right, say you shoot fatso. What's in it for me? So, are you sure this isn't going to be too intense for you? Maybe, but it's something I need to do. Well, why don't we just ease into it then? Take it nice and slow. Uh, what's going on with the hand down there? Uh, foreplay? Isn't this what you wanted? No! I need advice about helping my son come out of the closet. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I thought this was a booty call. McCool kept talking about... I think he said fishing. He's all upset my husband went without him. Oh, it was hard to understand McCool. He was so distraught. Oh, this is embarrassing. Don't worry about it. And a little disappointing. Oh, why? Well... You're gorgeous. Oh, stop. So, about your son... <laughs> gorgeous? How? Just curious. But, uh, what would you do to a gal like me? Give me a, for instance. <laughs> Whoa, that is something. So, where do these scissors I keep hearing about come into it? <gasps> You guys are not going to believe this, but, but I think Mom might be gay. <laughs> and the hits just keep coming. Petey, this is huge. Who'd have thought Ma was a Lebanese? Can you imagine what it must have been like for her in the old neighborhood? Carrying the desire that dare not speak its name? Yeah, they weren't big on that back home. And they hated people who said stuff like, dare not speak its name. So what are we gonna do? Give her the love and acceptance she deserves. Duh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but uh, don't come right out and tell her we know. I mean, she might not be ready for that. Good idea. I'm gonna show her I'm behind her 100%. This much fun since I switched your birth control pills with breath mints. <laughs> That's why I've been so minty down there. Why is there nothing on this boat but beer and grappa? Cause Jimmy says cocaine and boating don't mix. This is pointless. We need money. 
For a jolly pirate crew, you guys ain't too jolly. Jolly pirates? We did it to survive a brutal civil war. We fled to Canada for a better life. But now, we are being deported. We need money for an immigration lawyer fast. Problem is, your crew's too small. You need a few more hands on deck. Please! Where could I possibly find experienced hijackers in Regina Beach? You thinking what I'm thinking? Honestly, I don't even know if I'm thinking what I'm thinking. You ever hear voices, Jimmy? Ma, there's a secret living in this house. An elephant in the room, if you will. I know, Petey. A big, gay elephant. <laughs> that elephant needs to know they're loved and supported. I couldn't agree more. What about Papa Elephant? We'll tell Papa Elephant when the gay elephant is good and ready. And when the time comes, that elephant is not going to be alone. No, that elephant isn't. <laughs> I'm glad we cleared this up. It's good to get things out in the open. It sure is. I feel sorry for families that don't know how to communicate. <sighs> Ahoy there, Cappy! Avast, you landlubbers! What are you doing? This is not some dress-up game. Ah, come on. Who doesn't want to be a pirate? You boys need our help, and you know it. <sighs> Fine. We're desperate, and you Canadians are very helpful. By the way, real pirates don't dress like that. But I already cut off my hands. What'd you do that for? A pirate's gotta have a hook. Quickly, where is the hat now? We must put it on ice immediately. Here it is. Mm. All right, all hands on deck. Oh, sorry, Cheech. I've come to terms with my choice. Uh, Mom? Yes, Petey? There's this pride rally downtown this afternoon, and... It'd be an honor to be beside my boy. Now that the elephant's out of the closet, let's parade it through the streets. Gay. And the little Dutch boy wasn't poking his finger in your dike. What the hell were you doing? I told you, it was nothing. That was not nothing, young man. Spit it out. Ugh, fine. But I think it'd be easier if I showed you. If he comes back in a dress, I'm gonna sh The Elven Spellcaster, a seventh level mage. I don't understand a word you just said. I'm a LARPer. What is that, Swedish for loser? No, it's live action role playing, LARP. We dress up in costumes. Oh, it's, it's like when you dress up as a French maid or put on a leather gimp suit, right? No, that's good wholesome fun. I got no freaking idea what this is. <sighs> Problem is, you've been picking the wrong targets, Getty. What you want is an RV. Them things are packed with a king's ransom at treasure. <gasps> what about your uncle's hand? We need to go to a hospital. Ah, that'll be fine. He's had so many beers, he can't feel nothing. Ah, that's better. There's a galleon on the port bow. Or is it stopping? Which one's left? Oh, I used to know this. <laughs> Get pirate insurance, I said. You never know, I said. But would you listen? I'm going to watch TV. And I don't care if it drains the battery. Ah, prepare to be boarded, you scurvy dogs. Hoist the mizzen what sits on the wibble wobble. How? Oh, where'd he get those? It's standard now on all American-made RVs. God bless the NRA. Oh. Dave, the pirates are here. 
I still don't get it. Is LARP a sport? Not exactly. Do you win prizes? No, we get experience points. Then we use those to level up and... Shut up! I stopped listening after no. None of this makes sense. Patience. All will be revealed. Roar! A minotaur! Back, foul creature! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Fireball! Fireball! Ow! Watch it! That was really close to my eye! Roar! Backstab! Double damage! And confetti death blow! So, Ma, what'd you think? I think I'm gonna confetti death blow my f***ing brains out. That was the most mortifying thing I've ever seen. Why can't you pick up a nice drug habit like a normal kid? What happened to supporting me no matter what? That was when you were gay, not when you were a fairy. I'm an elf. I wish I was a fairy. That's a whole other level. You need to learn sixth level enchantments and... Enough! This is just unnatural. Well, this is who I am. No, it's not. You're chosen to be this way. All you need to do is, I don't know, meet the right girl. Oh, this is all my fault. I should have pushed him into sports. Oh. It gets better, Petey. Trust me, it does not get better. One more score like this and you'll have immigration lawyers coming out your ass! Damn, it's fun being a pirate! It's not meant to be fun. We do it for survival! What about pillaging? That part's fun, right? So are Vikings! <gasps> we should be those next! So what do we do with this scallywag? Make him walk the plank! <laughs> uh. Ooh. Oh. Open up. Go away. Okay, he's in there. Get him! <gasps> Cast out the foul demon, Father. The power of Christ compels you. Ah, lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! See, Father? What did I tell you? He's all wrapped up in the occult. I'm not possessed. I'm a LARPer. That's not a sin. But it's an abomination, isn't it? Tell him, Father. For oh, heavens, not at all. It's not as though he's gay. Get out of here, you intolerant jagoff! <laughs> I'm still not having this under my roof. Tell your friend to leave. Jetsy's my apprentice, and he's staying. I said scram, Dutchie! <laughs> Jetsy, wait! I don't care what she says. We're a team! <laughs> Free spell! Free spell! Wall of stopping! <sighs> what is wrong with you? We're not hurting anybody. I can't accept this. A grown boy pretending and make-believing? It's too weird. Too weird? In a family that used to pretend everything was normal while our father was out running a crime syndicate? A family, Italian, mind you, that now lives as Scottish Canadians under an assumed name? Face it, Mom. Our whole life is one big LARP. Double glitter truth bomb. Just stop it, you freak. Hey, that priest dropped his holy water. Ow! Oh, it burns! It burns! <laughs> Jimmy, stop! The joke's over! <laughs> Take that, you salty dog! <laughs> Ow! Enough! You two are crazy and dangerous! Of course we are! We're pirates, for Christ's sake! No, you're not! You're idiots! Consider yourselves fired! Ha! We just got Jolly Roger. You know, Jimmy, I don't even think them guys was real pirates. <laughs> hey, McCool! Ooh. Casey and Finnegan! What happened to Cheech's hand? Best an accident. <laughs> but we got it on ice. I knew you shouldn't have gone fishing without me. Hop on, gentlemen, for Canada, where universal health care even covers stupidity. Aw, <laughs> oh, 
this just feels stupid now. Maybe mom's right. We're just a bunch of losers in bathrobes tossing paper balls at each other. Whoa, who is that? Red hair and purple robes? Where have I seen that color scheme before? Thunder fists, eardrum shatter, dazzle pop, berserker thumb, allergy spell. Feel the wrath of Flindor McDougal. Go ahead, do it, Mom. Did you say Mom? No wonder people think we're losers. Oh. Thunder purse, thunder purse, sanitary napkin, electric shoe. Mom! I'm not Mom. I'm Cookie the Concubine. <laughs> you mean conqueror. I just picked a word, Petey. <laughs> what the heck is a thunder purse? I don't know, but it just saved your life, you little prick. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. That was great. I thought about what you said, and... You were right. But for God's sake, don't let your father know about this. He's not going to like the idea of his son dressing up in costumes. Avastar, it's a sea gremlin. Get him, Jimmy. Come here. <laughs> Dad, stop. That's my friend. You're next, help. Oh, God. Thank you for knowing what I was. Aye, there be the booty I've been craving. <laughs> Saskatchewan, la 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 la, la 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 la, la 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 la.